Hey, howdy ho neighbor, how are we doing today? Um, what we got here today is, well, first of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give a shout out to my friend Doug, who lives up in uh, Charlotte County. And he has these big greenhouses that he grows stuff in all winter. And uh, uh, we're going to be going there pretty soon on a field trip. And I'm going to show you exactly all the stuff he grows. But anyways, I wanted to show you this. He grows strawberries here in Wisconsin. And he heats that greenhouse, of course, with a wood stove and everything. And he heats it. And it, it is just beautiful in there. And he grows strawberries. Look at these strawberries. I mean, they're not the biggest strawberries. But let me tell you, these are all pure, organic grown strawberries. And they are the tastiest things. Like I said, they're not the biggest, but let me tell you, they are well worth the taste. And uh, just look at these. Are they beautiful or not? Just gorgeous. Just simply gorgeous. So, and of course, Doug being the nice guy that he is, let me mean Judy picks up. It ain't so nice. Yeah. But anyways, back to what I was get, get, getting to here. Yeah. You know, put these down. We won't eat them now. I'm gonna eat them with my Cheerios this morning. Remember I was I said I was going to uh, get some night crawlers from the store because I raise a lot of night crawlers downstairs in my basement. And of course, I do out in the garage now that the weather's getting nicer. And uh, somebody asked me if you could raise night crawlers that you buy from the store. And I said, you know, I have no idea. I've never tried it uh, because I got my night crawlers from up north in my night crawler bed up at the other place up, up by the family farm there. So I told my uh, viewers, I said, you know, I'm going to do a video and I'm going to try that. So, this is what I did. I got myself a little bucket, because I'm only going to put a dozen night crawlers in here. And I, I got my garden dirt, just like I do my other worm beds, my night crawler beds that I have. Same material, same exact thing. I'm going to feed them all natural. So, I told Judy, I said, Judy, we got to stop and get a dozen night crawlers. I'm going to tell you why I don't buy night crawlers. Okay, I got a dozen night crawlers. 12 night crawlers, it says in here. They want, I don't know if you can see that or not, $3.49 per dozen. I said, you got to be shitting me. Whoops, I shouldn't say uh, forward. I mean, you got to be kidding me. Three dollars and forty-nine cents for a dozen night crawlers. Come on, that's ridiculous. I grow them here for nothing. But that's not what I'm experimenting with. I'm experimenting with uh, these night crawlers to see if I can actually breed and raise these in captivity that you buy from the store for three dollars and forty-nine cents. Boy, that irritates me. Why I would pay a price like that for a dozen night crawlers. Let's take a look at them. Well, they're nice looking night crawlers. I will admit that. Looks like they have some potential. They're not as lively as my night crawlers. Uh, they look half dead. They look half dead to me. Maybe they'll uh, survive. They'll see how they do in here. But uh, I am going to see if we can breed night crawlers. Bought from the store. You saw it right here. Took them right out of there. A dozen night crawlers. And because I'm a uh, Night crawler freak, because I've been doing this for a long, long time, uh, indoors, indoors and outdoors, and very successfully too. Yes, 
So we're going to see if we can actually breed and grow these and maybe raise some babies. Okay. So if you like my Nightcrawler, uh, you'll see a lot of my Nightcrawler videos right on Dave the Family Farmer. Subscribe to my channel and uh, we're going to see how this goes. Uh, later on today, we're going to be digging into my garden worm bed. See how that's doing. Hey, y'all take care. Bye-bye then.